Welcome back, beautiful collective, and thank you so much for joining me here. Collective energy, let's get straight to your messages, please. So someone is thinking about solutions here. Collective energy, please and thank you. Collective, mm. let's see what this says. Express your joy. Forgive and forget. Hmm. Let's go. Let's go. Collective energy. Collective energy. It's like be of service. Rejuvenate and seek hidden treasure here. Go for your dreams. Telling you to go for your dreams here. Hmm. This one. I know it's an older deck, but it's very helpful. Oh. Patience. Heart chakra. Moving forward. Forgiving and forgetting. Well, I don't know about forgetting, but it's learning to forgive. It's like, go for your dreams. This is like a material harvest here. So, there's been a heartache, a loss. Hmm. Someone's got to face their shadow here. Your passions are ignited. This is uh, partnerships and alliances. Okay, so somebody is hoping and wishing that you, you would forgive. Let's get to it. Someone's hoping you will forgive them. They feel stupid. They're facing their shadow. This person is like, I just need to hold you in my arms. Someone's hoping you're going to, I tried looking for you and others and failed. Unsuccessful mission. They're hoping you're going to forgive and forget. Don't judge the present me for who I was in the past. You did nothing wrong. It was just me. Someone is saying I'm in a better space now. This is an explosion of pent-up energy. What's going on? Partying with their friends to help distract them. A lustful energy took this person over, but they're in a better headspace now. Every day I feel this emptiness. I can't concentrate on anything. I love you. Uh, somebody may be keeping their distance from you and Someone's got a lot of pent-up energy. Someone is getting hit with bad luck and bad karma. And they're hoping, wishing that you will forgive them. What did this person do to want forgiveness for? What did this person do? Why do they want forgiveness? cheating a friend is not just a friend something more okay so this person was heavy flirting via text or sexting there is cheating 
they settled rather than to break up. So this person settled for less. They had bad motives. And they're trying to get sympathy from you. It was a mistake and now they're feeling regretful. They're trying to control you. They manipulated you. They're playing dumb. And they've been complaining about you to others. It's like... They were manipulating you, diminishing your problems, and playing up their own. They have an emotional connection with someone else, but they're hiding it. They may have some serious addiction to prostitutes, gambling, or another expensive habits. They were putting you down, putting labels on you, and judging you to attack your self-esteem. It's like you might have been at a crossroads where you felt like, is this my intuition or am I overthinking a situation? This person had you really, really confused here. This person was trying to control you. They could have, if something could have broken out, this is a release of pent-up energy. You might have had the final straw with this person. They could have abandoned you, breadcrumbed you. They settled. Yet, they knew that you were their happiness. They figured, well, They feel stupid because they blamed you. But they know that the truth is, is that it was them. You did nothing wrong. They were playing around. They could have an addiction, an addiction to one specific fetish or something like this. <clears throat> it could be to gambling, it could be to prostitution, it could be whatever. It's like you may have been patient with this person and something was the straw that broke the camel's back here. This person was manipulating and now they feel stupid. They regret. They tried replacing you, but the mission failed. And now they've gotten caught somehow here juggling. It, it's like this person, you they may have walked away from you or you walked away. It's like a friend is more than a friend. Hmm. They have emotional connection to someone else.
Could have been sexting or texting. I don't know. It's like... person was talking about you to someone else to a friend but a, a friend is more than a friend here they were cheating you could have thought Am I imagining things? Is this my intuition? Or am I overanalyzing a situation? This person was trying to manipulate you to control you. They were judging you and labeling you. Hmm. This is secrets. It's like they could have promised someone to end something with you or they were talking uh, about it. They're getting hit with bad luck and bad karma. Trying to lower your self-esteem. They're exposing themselves. abundance and they can't stand to see that you got it made plotting and scheming is part of their lifestyle so it's like spirit is saying go for your dreams it's like this person was out of touch they're cold-hearted they're out of touch with their own heart chakra and they cheat to fill an emotional void or they're playing the victim pretending about money matters hmm. somebody is doing witchcraft casting spells in order to control the situation and they're getting hit with bad luck and bad karma. If 
This also can mean sex and taboo sex. It's like this person had, might have one particular fetish. And their fetish could be like gambling, prostitution, engaging with sexual partners. It's something taboo going on here. They've been hiding from you. And it's almost like they want you to doubt yourself. They're really acting cold-hearted here. Or they have expensive habits. And they've been hiding that. They got some kind of expensive habit that they've been hiding a sexual addiction um gambling drugs Somebody was pretending that somebody was just a friend, but they're not. It's a very serious addiction to prostitutes, gambling, or other expensive habits. Whoever it is, is getting hit with bad karma. Hmm. That could be causing intimacy issues. It is your significant other that was sending... Uh, negativity your way. Somebody is dabbling around with witchcraft. To put negative thoughts in your head or their head. It's like they're trying to make you miss an opportunity.
Like I said, somebody... It's all about control. Twisting the facts by altering reality with lies or misstatements in order to confuse you. So somebody deliberately tried to confuse you. They wanted to control you. They wanted you doubting yourself. They were name calling or labeling you. They were trying to like make you feel insecure about yourself. Well, now they're feeling the emotional loss of you. This person, uh, settled. They tried to replace you, but the mission failed. I think that this person tried to dominate you. I think that this person wanted to dominate you. I think they wanted to control you. And I think they tried to step on you to make themselves feel superior to you to make you doubt yourself that's why you're being asked to reflect on your truth don't listen to this person listen to your own truth this person settled They tried to replace you, but they failed. I think that this person was engaging with unhealthy habits to make you feel insecure about your own sexuality. Wondering if you were enough, if you were good enough, because they wanted to control you. Complete control of you. You should be glad to be away from this person because they were not good for you. They had bad motives. This is a person you should not trust at all. So if you're away from them, it's a good thing. Take care. <laughs>